Roblox Limited. You know, those things sometimes worth thousands of dollars that sit in your inventory and rot away. Sometimes if you have an item that nobody wants, it's absolute garbage. It can stay with you for a really, really long time. For days, for months. But what if I told you, I have not one, but two limiteds that I have not traded or even touched in over six years. Please leave a like on this video if you find it entertaining. Subscribe. Comment down below the longest you have ever owned a Roblox limited item for. And turn on post notifications so you never miss my next video. Anyways guys, my story dates all the way back to 2014. Six years ago when I got both the items I am talking about in today's video. The first item was the Halloween baseball cap 2014. This was a free Roblox item that came out as a celebration for Halloween in 2014 and was just another regular hat that Roblox put out on the catalog for the price of 10 tickets. If you don't know what tickets are, it's basically an old currency Roblox had back then that worked like Robux but was worth a lot less. I think the usual conversion was 10 tickets for one Robux, so tickets were worth one tenth of Robux. I've completely forgotten when this hat went limited and I can't find any traces online, but all I know is that it was a couple years after Halloween 2014 because I've had it in my inventory ever since then. The second limited item that I've owned for over six years is the pumpkin pie phones. This was another hat meant for a Roblox holiday celebration, and that holiday was none other than Thanksgiving. Unlike the Halloween baseball cap, the pumpkin pie phones was an event item that was given out in a Roblox game, The Mad Murderer. Basically the same thing as events nowadays that give out items. As you guys know, the Ready Player 2 event and RB Battles event happened a few days ago where you got items from playing games. Those actually have a chance of going limited, such as how the Pumpkin Pythons did. In the game The Mad Murderer, a lot of veteran Roblox players may remember this game as it was one of the top murder mystery games back in the day. It used to actually be the most popular but Murder Mystery 2 eventually took that spot after the game fell off and stopped getting updates. According to the Roblox wiki, this item became limited three years later on November 12th, 2017. There's no crazy story on why I have kept these items for so long, except for the fact that I forgot about them and never put them into trades or sold them. They're both worth under a thousand Robux, so no one really ever offered on them or asked for me to add them in trades. If these were limited when I first started trading, they would probably both be gone by now, but since they went limited when I already had some value and larger items, they have just sat in my inventory ever since. I'm glad I kept these over the years because they're kind of a symbol of old Roblox in my childhood. These were hats that I actually bought or won when I was a kid six years ago and still have them to this day. That's kind of crazy to think about, but I'm also curious of all the other small items that I had that went limited, but that I have it off. As for these two limiteds, I'm probably going to try and keep them forever unless I accidentally put them in a trade or accept a trade containing them. I think my value is high enough to the point where I don't need to trade these two small things off to worry about profit and hopefully they can remain in my inventory for my rest of the time on Roblox. Only time will tell but I'm really glad I decided to keep them and hold them for so long. Anyways guys, that's the end of the video. I'm curious to know if you guys have any limited items sitting in your account that you plan on never trading and the story behind them. Make sure to tell me in the comments down below. Leave a like on this video if you found it enjoyable, subscribe, and turn on post notifications so you never miss my next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a good day. As always, Kevy out.